Yo, hi guys, Kevin here. Welcome back to another Assetto Corsa video. Um, if you're on the Facebook group, um, Assetto Corsa Drift Community, I think it is, um, you'll see there's a few new tracks dropping. Um, Ibisu West, which I'm going to run this game, um, th this video, sorry. Um, there's Ibisu Higashi as well. Um, Mikawa Motorland. There's quite a few different tracks coming out, so I want to try and drift those. Uh, but this episode I'm going to go with um, Ibisu West. I have run this track a long time ago, it was probably like R Factor I think it was. Uh, so it's been a very, 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 very long time uh, since I have run this track. Um, I'm running the S15, if you can see here. Uh, very nice car. Beautiful car at the same time of being really, 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 probably my favourite drifter on this game. Um, so yeah, very nice looking car. Uh, just perfect really. Um, so we got some replay cameras as well which is nice um, I don't know where that wall is <laughs> I'm going to have to try and find it but what a fucking start I just drove into the fucking wall <laughs> it's all fun huh it's all fun okay so so I was just getting my bearings a little bit I just drove up there to see uh, okay I recognise this now I recognise this um, there was a section we was running on R Factor a long time ago. I'm trying to remember it. It's, it involves this corner here. <laughs> I just need to try and remember. Oh, okay. On R Factor's track, I think you can link that corner into this far corner down there. So I think they shortened this bit <laughs> quite a bit. But um, Let's throw it into here and see. And then you take it into this bit here, yeah. Round here. Yeah, there we go. But then you, what you could do on the R Factor track was link this bit into that far corner by like taking out wide here and going back in here. But it seems to be a lot longer in this version, so I think this version is probably more realistic. <laughs> Um, so, if we just run this section a few times, um, just not linking that bit basically. Ooh that was close to the grass. I had to use the handbrake quite a bit then. <laughs> Fucking hell. Oh, that's terrible. It didn't take it out wide enough. So, if we were to try and link this in, we'd have to go backwards and forwards quite a few times. Yeah, it's not the same. And this bit here is a lot tighter than the R-Factor version as well. You never used to drop tyres on that curb behind you, so... Ooh, bit wide. Uh, too wide. Fucking too wide, me. Me laddie. Uh, but yeah, I'm sure there's a lot more sections on here. Uh, I'm going to have a bit of an explore. After the... Uh, yeah, let's have an explore now, fuck it. Let's just follow the track around. Uh, like I said, it's been a very, very long time since the last ran this track, so... We're watching a few YouTube videos on it, but from that you can't really... It's hard to grasp the track when you're watching a, a YouTube video, you know? Okay, got a bit of a straight coming on. We've got another long straight as well, so... <coughs> I don't know how this uh, goes up here. Really can't remember up here. Is it just quite literally a hairpin? No. Okay. Oh, okay. I, I think I remember this from a YouTube video actually. Yeah, the hairpin. The amount of YouTube videos you see with this hairpin in it is crazy. Sorry for running pretty shitty at the moment, but you know, just trying to learn the track a little bit more. Um, yeah, but in terms of sections, I'd probably say um, this section around here is probably the best one. Yeah, well, I'd probably say that's the most enjoyable section out of them all. What you could do is take it down this bit here and then take it through that bit. I might try that. So like if you come down here and try and take it out wide here and then you come into this bit, that's a bit bouncy actually. 
That is very bouncy. <laughs> Let's see how it goes though, at full speed. Ah, too much angle, bruh. So if we're to take it down here, take it a bit more to the left. Okay, this is going to be bouncy. This is going to be fucking... Whoa -hoo -hoo. We made it, though. Whoa, that's bouncy, too. Okay, that's not as much <laughs> as, as a smooth section, you know? <laughs> it's not the same. <laughs> it's a little bit more bouncy. That's gone wide. I've gone wide. Oh, shit. See? Look how tight that track is. I'm pretty sure it's not that tack, um, tight on the um, old R Factor track. I'm pretty sure. Okay, let's go back down this way. Okay, uh, okay, okay. Let's go to have another track though, Ibusu West. I'm sure this is going to be run on a lot of tracks online. Um, so I'm going to have to keep learning this track, even though it's not. There's not a lot to learn, to be fair. Let's 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 admit it. Like, there's not a lot to learn. Probably this little section up here. Oh no, I'm on the grass. Oh my god. Oh, I'm backwards. 360! <laughs> oh, I fucked up that corner. But yeah, it was, I, this was mostly about showcasing this track as well. I get it out there for you guys. Um, the link to the video where the person released this track is in the description. So go to see the video, check out his video, give it a like. Um, because we were all appreciate him for making tracks like this, so you gotta show him some love, you know. Okay, I don't like that way, it's a bit too bumpy. Um, so let's just go back to our normal section. Oh, I fucking lost it. What am I drifting like tonight? Today, this morning. <laughs> it's a fucking morning. I said tonight, today, this morning. <laughs> Took me a while to get there, but fucking hell. Yeah, apologize for my drifting, but you know, it's, mo it's mostly about showcasing, showcasing the track, uh, getting it out there for you guys. So, apologies for the drifting. If you see me online, I'm not this bad. <laughs> Yeah, it just doesn't feel the same as like the R Factor one. I think the R Factor one was not as realistic as this track. I don't know if it's just me. It's, if, if, if anyone else has run this track yet, uh, please let me know. Because I can remember linking in from that last corner down that back street down there. You could quite literally go out wide to about probably touching the, touching the wall. And then you'd come back down to this side and you'd be able to throw it in that way. But I don't know if it's maybe the cars on here. Like they haven't got... Obviously, our factor tires were pretty shit. Um, so that might have been like the tires or something. I don't know. It just it just doesn't feel the same as it did on our factor, which is a good thing. It's more realistic, I guess. Uh, but then we don't know what is more realistic. But I'm guessing this track because it looks very nice. I'm not gonna lie. Spent a lot of time on this track, so you can only imagine it's perfect. So yeah, thank you to the guy who made this. Uh, let's do one more, one more. Um... Ooh, get some power. I'm going too wide. No, I'm really, really struggling on this track. But it's all about learning them. It's all about learning the tracks. Uh, Apologise for the shit drifting, uh, but it's more, it's more about the track. So hope you guys appreciate that. Um, let's do one more lap. Seeing as I did fuck that up, pretty, pretty. Alright, one more lap, here we go. Let's just throw this fucker down.
I haven't gone wide, which is a good thing. <laughs> it started well. <laughs> Gonna drop tyres here, it's just... Can't help it. Bit too wide, no. Rescued. Rescued from the death. And then you take it out around this bit. And throw it into the hairpin. Lovely, it's a nice little section to be fair. Uh, be good to run it online with a few people, but yeah. Hope you guys enjoyed this, and if you did, give it a thumbs up. Check out the track, it's in the description below. And yeah, I'll see you guys next time.